Hi, I'm Timothy and thanks for tuning in to another video on Armor of God. It's another video about spiritual warfare, and we really do hope you'll learn something by the end of this video. As always, if it's not too much of a hassle, please share this video on your Facebook and Twitter to help spread this message. And so now, buckle up and let's get on with the video. On February 22, 1931, our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ appeared to this simple nun, bringing with him a wonderful message of mercy for all mankind. Sister Faustina tells us in her diary under this date, In the evening when I was in my cell, I became aware of the Lord Jesus clothed in a white garment. One hand was raised in blessing, the other was touching the garment at the breast. From the opening of the garment at the breast, there came forth two large rays, one red and the other pale. In silence I gazed intently at the Lord. My soul was overwhelmed with fear, but also with great joy. After a while Jesus said to me, Paint an image according to the pattern you see, with the inscription, Jesus, I trust in you. Some time later, our Lord again spoke to her. The pale ray stands for the water which makes souls righteous. The red ray stands for the blood which is the life of souls. These two rays issued forth from the depths of my most tender mercy at that time, when my agonizing heart was opened by a lance on the cross. Fortunate is the one who will dwell in their shelter, for the just hand of God shall not lay hold of him. Sister Faustina was a young, uneducated nun in a convent of the Congregation of Sisters of Our Lady of Mercy in Poland during the 1930s. She came from a poor family that struggled during the years of World War I. She had only three years of simple education, so hers were the humblest tasks in the convent, usually in the kitchen or garden. However, she received extraordinary revelations or messages from our Lord Jesus. Jesus asked Sister Faustina to record these experiences, which she compiled into notebooks, and these notebooks are known today as the Diary of St. Maria Faustina Kaolska, and the words contained within are God's loving message of divine mercy. And so in this video, I'd like to share with all of you what our Lord Jesus said to Sister Faustina about spiritual warfare, since this channel is, well, talking about the subject of spiritual warfare. Child, you are not yet in your homeland. So go, fortified by my grace, and fight for my kingdom in human souls. Fight as a king's child would. My daughter, I want to teach you about spiritual warfare. Never trust in yourself, but abandon yourself totally to my will. In desolation, darkness, and various doubts, have recourse to me and to your spiritual director. He will always answer you in my name. Do not bargain with any temptation. Lock yourself immediately in my heart, and at the first opportunity, reveal the temptation to the confessor. Put your self-love in the last place, so that it does not taint your deeds. Bear with yourself with great patience. Do not neglect interior mortifications. Always justify to yourself the opinions of your superiors and of your confessor. Shun murmurs like a plague. Let all act as they like. You are to act as I want you to. Observe the rule as faithfully as you can. If someone causes you trouble, think what good you can do for the person who caused you to suffer. Do not pour out your feelings. Be silent when you are rebuked. Do not ask everyone's opinion, but only the opinion of your confessor. Be as frank and simple as a child with him. Do not become discouraged by ingratitude. Do not examine with curiosity the roads down which I lead you. When boredom and discouragement beat against your heart, run away from yourself and hide in my heart. Do not fear struggle. Courage itself often intimidates temptations and they dare not attack us. Always fight with the deep conviction that I am with you. Do not be guided by feeling because it is not always under your control, but all merit lies in the will. I will not delude you with prospects of peace and consolations. On the contrary, prepare for great battles. Know that you are now on a great stage where all heaven and earth are watching you. Fight like a knight, so that I can reward you. Do not be unduly fearful, because you are not alone. I want you to become like a knight experienced in battle, 
who can give orders to others amid the exploding shells. In the same way, my child, you should know how to master yourself amid the greatest difficulties, and let nothing drive you away from me, not even your falls. Well, that's all for this video. For those of you who are interested to know more about what our Lord Jesus said to St. Faustina, I've provided the link in the description box below. And for those of you who are still watching this video at this point, thanks so much for taking the time to do so, and God bless you.